of Waldorf education, and I, I especially have a, a fondness for the early childhood programs in the Waldorf schools because they really take the child and, and look at what the, what the child needs at their particular age, and they build on that. Um, a lot of times in the Waldorf school, we're meeting parents when their children are two or three or four years old for the first time, and it's it's really a wonderful opportunity to work with parents even when children are younger than that and think about things like how often are children restrained in plastic containers during the day so there's the high chair, playpen, crib, car seat, walkers um, and how often are they on the floor when the older school will call it tummy time Mm -hmm. um, even infants, how, how much opportunity do they have to roll around and to crawl and to be doing the things physiologically through movement that they need to do that's very much connected with their success in school later. I think what I love the most is the idea that children can have lots of time to grow into um, learning and that the process of learning happens very naturally for young children. We don't have to sit at desks and we don't have to do reading and writing. Um, we can play and learn tremendous things, particularly out in nature. In the Waldorf Kindergarten, it's, it's very much a, a sensory, uh, rich sensory experience. And so we use a lot of natural materials. There's wood and there's wool. And as far as toys go or things they play with, it's, it's not it's, more towards naturally formed objects rather than man-made formed objects. There's a lot of blocks that are made out of logs. There's big stumps. There's uh, uh, trestles, which are like tripod things that you can clip cloth onto so that they can make houses and tents. There's a focus on thinking about things or uh, analyzing emotions or feelings and Really, there's a, there's a much simpler and more practical physiological approach to working with a toddler or an infant and making sure that they're watching people do things that are worthy of imitation because all they really want to do is follow us around and do what we do. The other thing that's very different, I think, is the outdoor time that we spend almost half of our day outside no matter what the weather. So nature is such a great place for children to play and they don't need any any tools for that. You can put them on a pile of dirt and they're quite happy and learn all kinds of wonderful things. I am truly a believer in Waldorf education and I think it's such a gift to children and I, I hope that more and more children come.